Manuports are natural objects like rocks or fossils that have been picked up and moved without being modified. So if you got a pile of cool rocks that you found out in the wild and took home, then you got a collection of manuports. And people have been picking up and making manuports out of things since before modern Homo sapiens even existed. Possibly the oldest and most famous manuport is this pebble called the Makikansgat pebble. It's about three inches in diameter and looks like it's got a face on it. And it was found in a dolomite cave in South Africa in 1925. Based on sedimentary analysis in the cave and nearby finds of Australopithecus africanus fossils, it's believed that this rock with a face on it was transported into that cave some two to three million years ago. The reason it's thunk to have been moved there is because it's primarily composed of jasperite. And jasperite isn't found anywhere else in the cave, and the nearest deposit is 32 kilometers away. Another interesting manuport is a fossilized fragment of cuttlefish bone called the Erfoud manuport. I think I'll have to stay right here because if I move out of the way, it really does look like a quote, perfectly naturalistic and life-size human phallus. It was found near some tools during an archaeological excavation near Erfoud in eastern Morocco. And it was believed to have been deposited there some two to three hundred thousand years ago. Obviously, we can't know exactly why these prehistoric manuports were manuported. But many archaeologists and anthropologists think that whoever moved them must have thought they looked cool. Some even think that the Makapanskat pebble is the earliest evidence we have for symbolic thinking. So next time you pick up a rock and move it from where you found it, you're participating in a hominid tradition that predates even the existence of Homo sapiens. Thanks for watching, and if you can or could help support this GoFundMe to help save Amir and his family in Gaza, I'd appreciate it.